Let's talk about Shandilo and the participatory budgeting project they've been working in partnership with CABS to pilot. Participatory budgeting is a way for community members to be involved in the distribution of funds in their local area. Essentially, funds are identified, the community discusses what their needs are, and then members of the community step up to offer a solution. We have asked Landila what is important to them, and the three priorities identified were children, young people, and green spaces. You should have received some leaflets through your door. You may have seen the banners around town. We've placed the information in shops and there's been a lot shared over social media. The good news is that the project proposals are in and you, the community of Flandilo, now have the responsibility to decide which of the nine projects will be funded. Good luck all. The voting will take place between February the 17th and up to 5pm on February the 26th. The first proposal is for a boxing gym in Llandilo, offering training sessions and a new activity to young people in the town who are looking for a healthy way to keep fit, increase confidence, maintain discipline and have fun. The Bee Bombs project involves children from all three local schools and adults in the creation of wildflower areas across Llandilo and surrounding areas, embracing nature and providing spaces for the community to come together. A school Broden Ever would like to further develop their nature project and this brings exciting developments to benefit the community as a whole. Working with a host of partners to support these improvements, it will offer opportunities aplenty. Gav Kamenidol Askol Vaivach would like to further develop the school garden for use by the pupils, elderly and local community. The new design will be guided by the pupils themselves and the chickens will also be rehoused. Vaivach Park, planting of trees and a willow structure in the park, working with schools and TFD, they're offering to create a natural solution to managing the changing climate and would like to involve the whole community. The Young People's Creative Empowerment Programme aims to empower children and young people to develop their own resilient toolkit to confidently pursue a career within the creative industry. The Tylo Sant Library and Wellbeing Hub at Tylo Sant School involves the creation of a quiet area dedicated to support mental wellbeing with a predominantly Welsh library for the use of several primary schools. Proposal number eight is for the creation of a locally based tree nursery to provide free native saplings for regreening projects in the town and surrounding areas. Working with Permaculture Tawi, this project can benefit the whole community and support a lasting green legacy. And finally, the last proposal is an extension to an orchard and their apple processing to make more of the produce of the Deneva Orchard and other local orchards, extending the spiral orchard and involving local schools in various activities. So what comes next, Landilo? CAVs have made £10,000 available through the Welsh Assembly Government Transformation Fund and your community is in the process of trying to match it. There is a Just Giving campaign, donation boxes through the town as well as appeals being made to local businesses and wider organisations. The key point of participatory budgeting is that you, as residents, have a huge part to play in the next stage. This really is a matter of one person, one vote. This is for your community and by your community, so please get involved and tell us which of these projects is your favourite. Due to COVID restrictions, the community event has had to alter to ensure community safety. Each of the nine proposed groups will be required to give a five minute presentation where they sell their projects to you, a cross between Dragon's Den, X Factor and a conversation with the bank manager if the bank manager lived next door to you, or with friends or family or part of your community group. These will be released on February the 17th at 12pm. You will then have until Saturday the 26th at 5pm to cast your vote. Votes will be made via the Connect Commandantshire platform and in person at Hengort. These votes will then be collated and the top voted proposal funded. There's more information coming your way over the next few weeks. You can also have a look at the Slendilo participatory budgeting page on CAV's website under engagement.
If you live in Llandilo and its immediate surrounding areas, then your voice is important. Regardless of your age, you have a right to have your say. Voting requirements will be explained closer to the time, but let's spend some money in Llandilo and fill some of the needs that you yourselves have identified. Participatory budgeting really is all about you.